He's a trailblazer in the women's revolution. He's got two hit television shows. Brie Bella, a billboard example of breaking the glass ceiling and pursuing all of your dreams. Am I the only one that has a problem with the fact that most of Brie Bella... is electric after that. What did we just see? Wow, just awesome. Now that's how you promote a bout. What's up, guys? Shots and I2G here, coming to you with another episode of WA2K19 Universe Mode, episode 3 of Women's wrestling and of course that means we have two big matches with evolution consequences on the line that doesn't even make sense but we'll roll with it we'll roll with it anyway uh as we saw at the start of the night however brie bella who as you can see had a match with sasha banks booked for tonight however Shayna baszler comes out of nowhere and lays out one half of the bella twins Shayna is now blaming Brie for her not winning at the Fatal 4-Way last week and thus heading on to the semi-finals of the WWE Women's Championship Tournament. That Fatal 4-Way was won by Sasha Banks, who along with Charlotte is in the semi-finals. Well, tonight we find out the third competitor in the Final Four of that. Also, tonight we have another Round 1 match in the Evolution Championship and Lana well she now has the spotlight she is wrestling here on women's wrestling but tonight she has a very formidable foe in Peyton Voice and then after that we have the third fatal four way so let's find out who will be the four tonight tonight the four will be Mickey James Becky Lynch Nikki Bella and Natalia. One of those four will be joining Sasha and Charlotte in the semi finals. And those semi finals will be happening in two weeks here on Women's 
wrestling so without further ado let us go straight into the action oh wait hold on hold on hold on there was one thing that also happened alexa bliss he will be in the final fatal 4 a.m match next week part of a women's championship matches of course she will be in that but she called out ronda rousey she also called out ronda rousey for cheek of this five feet of fury calling out a former ufc champion of course ronda rousey will eventually make her debut here on women's wrestling eventually like when the dlc actually becomes separate by my problem yes she will be here eventually but alexa bliss clearly wants some of ronda rousey first before anyone else will she get her wish well we'll find out in in the near future maybe in the near future but of course that's we'll worry about alexa bliss next week as i said she's in for final fatal four-way match but tonight we're focusing on the third fatal four-way match and the third match in round one of the Evolution Championship Tournament. Happy Lana Day! And from Moscow, the ravishing Russian, Lana! The Ravishing Russian has been ridiculed and written off her entire career, but here tonight she's looking to have the last laugh and crush the competition. Well, anybody that's ever ridiculed Lana doesn't know what they're talking about. She's incredibly beautiful, Byron, incredibly talented. Byron speaks like 31 languages. Byron was a former social ambassador for Rusev. Byron, Byron has none of those things. Whoa, well, I know, but Byron's criticized all the exciting superstars ready to square off here and there's nothing quite like seeing two superstars settling in in the ring and one-on-one -on -one action michael And we get underway with the pride of Moscow, Lana, looking to turn this Cold War red hot. Nice job by Lana. That's how you wear down your opponent. Showing absolutely no mercy on that attack to the neck. She goes for the cover. She's looking to get out of here with a win early. How in the world? Section. Peyton Royce got her there. Peyton Royce got her there. Focusing her attention on the body here. Oh, oh man! Knee drops. That was nasty. 
missed it. So precise. A lot of faltering some. When she agreed to this match, she knew this wasn't going to be easy. Pump the brakes a bit, Cole. I know exactly what you're thinking, and I can tell you with all certainty, she still has plenty of gas left in the tank. Close line! Well, that'll leave a mark. Oh, she doesn't care about fighting fair. I have no idea how the official missed her doing that. I mean, but she's taking advantage of it, that's for sure. Oh, she wants this win bad. Born in Australia, Peyton Royce's path to WWE saw her travel many miles, including a stop in Calgary, Alberta, Canada, where, like many before her, Peyton honed her craft before ultimately joining WWE. Peyton Royce got her there. She delivers the axe handle. What should Lana try to do differently at this stage to stay in this thing? She doesn't want to let this get out of control, guys. I really expected much more from her here tonight. Oh. Pretty shocked to see her absorb so much punishment. Corey, Byron did allude to Peyton Royce's training in Canada. Yeah, she's a product of your best friend, Lance Storm, and that's one of the reasons why Peyton is so good in the ring. I'm just glad Storm's personality didn't rub off on her during training. She is on fire. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, a drop kick to the spine. Whoa, oh, oh, Lana able to avoid damage. Slap. Oh, no, you didn't. Yes, she did. She keep her down. A schoolboy. Here we go. And a lot of powers out. She's still in this one. And Royce got her there. What's Peyton Royce about to make happen? She goes for the cover. Part of the four horse 
women. Hey, listen, I remember when Becky Lynch first came to NXT, she had moved to Orlando, Florida to be a personal trainer. Never thought she'd get the opportunity to be part of this company, and now she is one of the premier superstars in all women's division. Ready with much of the women's evolution. Indeed she is. And from Scottsdale, Arizona, Nikki Bella. Go ahead, Byron. Tell us about how inspired you are. Not just me, Corey, but the entire WWE Universe. Nikki Bella, she is fearless. She is driven. Great role model as well. You should strive to be more like Nikki Bella. The two television shows, former champion. The world wouldn't know what to do with two of me. Oh, gosh, don't even let it for the cover. Mickey James with an easy kick out. I knew she could do it. Now we have Nikki Bella on the attack. Oh my goodness, crushing it. Well, that's any indication she's not taking any prisoners in this one. So damaging. Spinning kick to the gut. Nikki just a force in that ring. Boy, the best seat in the house. Now we have Nikki Bella on the attack. Becky Lynch with the offense. Natalia looking a little bit surprised here. But you can bet there's still plenty of gas left in her tank. If you're worried about her now, you haven't seen many of her matches. She can withstand so much more punishment than this. She's really had a tough time getting out of the gates here tonight. She needs to make a change, and she needs to make it now. Look, Nikki James is on the attack now. Her knee finds the mark. Nikki just a force in that ring. Oh, I got the best seat in the house. She goes for the cover. That wasn't even close to three. Too soon. Slams her face down. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. There are two things that are crucial for success in a Fatal 4 match being resourceful and timing. And one is really the product of the other. There are so many things in this type of match a superstar has to keep in mind. And no count out and no disqualification means anything can happen and it's all legal. That's a difficult scenario anywhere you look at it, especially when you're going up against three other opponents. She appears to be in complete control of this one. Byron, earlier you talked about the importance of timing and being resourceful in a fatal four-way match. That reminded me of the number one contenders match we saw in Raw in April of 2017. Nia Jax, Alexa Bliss, Sasha Banks, and Mickie James collided to see who would face Bailey for her Raw Women's Championship. Let's just say in the end, Miss Bliss took advantage of a situation. The five feet of fury has her masters and doctorate in timing and resourcefulness. 
after Nia Jax sent Mickey James flying off the top rope and flattened Sasha Banks with a Samoan drop. Bliss blasted Nia out of the ring with a drop kick and pinned the boss to become number one contender to the Raw Women's Championship. It was brilliant. History was made on Monday Night Raw the night after the 2016 SummerSlam event. It was a special fatal four-way elimination match to crown a new Universal Champion. Victory could only be achieved by pinfall or submission. Either this is a cool on the mark. Perfectly executed, guys. Nikki Bella may have just ended this, fellas. There was oh. definitely a big fight feel, a main event feel that night on Raw. But can she follow up? What a huge opening for Natalia. Looks like Nikki Bella is taking the upper hand. That is a beautiful thing to watch. You can see the confidence just beaming on her right now. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. Oh, right off the second turnbuckle. Face first. What incredible impact. <laughs> oh, man. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. Seems to me, guys, like we're just moments away from seeing the finisher, which could... Peggy Lynch going for it. She's got the skill. Again, she ended here. <laughs> oh, man. Now we have Nikki Bella on the attack. Nikki just won a win for Natalya. Shockwave sent down the spine. <laughs> It. She's starting to get on a roll. Oh no, she's in a bad way now. She's not playing any games tonight. Everyone better watch out. Even me. Oh yeah, here's Natalia. She drops her with a clothesline. An all-out assault on the back. Now we have Nikki Bella on the attack. And oh right. my god, what a forearm! That's a job. Oh man! Natalia is a force within the ring. From what we've seen and heard tonight, there must be serious injuries. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. Here is your winner, Natalia. Very impressive win here in this fatal four-way. Wow. That was intense. And to be honest, I wouldn't have been surprised to see any one of these four win this one. And for three of these competitors, that is not how they do this one up. Well, can you believe it? Natalia, of all people in this match, picks up a victory, countering for Bex Bloder into a roll up and stealing, well, not even stealing, but using her wits to pick up the all important W in this match which now means Natalia joins Charlotte and Sasha Banks in the final four the final four to determine the WWE Women's Championship well three spots are now taken there is one spot left and we have one final fatal four way next week to determine the fourth woman in the final four also Peyton Royce dispatches of Lana to go through to the semi-finals of the evolution tournament that is it for episode three of women's wrestling a pretty short one bear in mind one of the matches didn't even get started and we had a promo from Alexa Bliss but that was easily the shortest of the fatal four-way matches we've had so far tune in next week for the final fatal four way and the final first match final round one match of the evolution tournaments i've been shown tonight 2g and thanks for watching